Hi guys, it's Patrick at Sports Medica. Today we're going to do some voodoo floss work at the top of the calf. So, what we're going to go for here, the calf is absolutely vital in so many movements. Uh, this guy is a lot of fun, so and it's pretty juicy as well. So anytime you've got a, a, a nice big muscle, you can really compress it. So we're going to put our little um, anchor on by just going going around, not putting too much strain through there. And then once that's nicely locked in, we're going to stretch and go for it. Okay, so every time that we stretch, we're going to put more compression into that area. So if we're not doing anything like that, there's not much compression. If you give it a big old pull and a yank, then we're getting an awful lot of compression. So we can come into here, and that's done pretty quickly. So from there, that's getting a nice amount of movement. So we can start off doing something nice and easy, just coming forwards and backwards like that, just coming through in, into that area. Or we can just start shooting that knee up and down in that way. We can start get, affecting the muscles on the outside a little bit by just grinding it through there. And again, that's starting to open up quite nicely. <coughs> so it's, um, with an area like this, I'd definitely do it about three times. You want to go in nice and tight to begin with, then get a little bit tighter, and then put it absolutely tightest at the uh, third uh, occasion. As you're doing that, again, you might feel a pretty nice sensation as the blood starts rushing through, and it should feel much, much looser. Once you've got it done, mobilize, get the whole thing working nice and easy, uh, and that should feel fantastic. Okay, any questions? Hit us up, guys.